Hello, my name is Dr. Ray Pope. Today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about chiropractic. I am a chiropractor. I live and work here on Camano Island in Washington State. I've been in practice for over 25 years now. So I have a little bit of an understanding of chiropractic and how it can best help you. I'd like to take a few minutes to answer some of the top 10 questions regarding chiropractic. I sometimes will have patients ask me or people who don't even know anything about chiropractic find out I'm a chiropractor and they'll ask me a question. One of the most common questions that I get is, what does chiropractic treat? Now that's a very good question because it does help us to understand what chiropractic can do for you and how it can help you. One of the most common answers to that, of course, is, well, back pain, headaches, neck pain. Those are traditional symptoms that chiropractors have great success with. Life is more than just back, neck pain, and headaches, though. We also have other possibilities of injuries and conditions that chiropractors can deal with very successfully. Some of those are what we call musculoskeletal system injuries, anything dealing with the muscles, the ligaments, and the joints. If you have a problem associated with a pain in a joint or extremity, a knee, a shoulder, that's also the domain of chiropractors, and we have great success in treating those conditions. Then, of course, there's other things that people don't even think about. Chiropractors have become the wellness providers for many, many people. Now, wellness is a great uh, purpose. It's a great thing for us to be shooting towards, is to develop our bodies and our minds and even our emotional states to the height of proper function and well-being. So wellness is a great place for you to understand a, a deeper level of just what chiropractic is capable of. And that's one of the things that's often missed when people are thinking, well, what does a chiropractor treat? So in understanding what chiropractic does, yes, we do take care of people who have back pains and headaches and neck pain, and we do that very well but we also take care of the whole body. We want the body to work perfectly, or at least as good as we can get it. And so we need your knees to be working right, and your feet to be properly functioning. We need all of your joints to be able to move freely and to feel good, because movement is such an important part of your ability to live life the way you choose to. So in closing, I'd like you to find out more about chiropractic. You can do that at my website, which is apchiro.com. That will tell, us, tell you about our office. Now, our office is in Kameno, um, in Washington State. So if you're looking for a chiropractor that is maybe a little closer to where you live, that's great. I commend you, and I want you to continue to watch this video because now I'd like to tell you, how's the best way to find a chiropractor who can help you with your particular condition or with your particular health goals? Now, um, chiropractors are only used by about 10 to 15 percent of the population. So that means there's a lot of people out there, maybe you're one of them, that is not even using chiropractic right now. And that's too bad because you're really missing out on a great opportunity to increase your level of health, increase your ability to stay well, and increase your comfort. And by finding the right chiropractor, someone that you can work with over a period of time to achieve your goals is essential. So one of the things that's going to help you do that is to ask around, ask family, friends, coworkers, People who live in your community who may or may, you know, have used a chiropractor. Maybe they've used a chiropractor that they don't want. Well, that's a valuable piece of information for you. You know, you can find out who to go to as well as maybe who you want to avoid. And another great way of learning who a good chiropractor is is to use your social network. These are people that you have developed, you know, your Facebook friends, your MySpace friends, some of your Twitter people, um, 
ask them, say, hey, I'm looking for a chiropractor. I need to know who you go to. Do you like them? Um, is he or she a great person or just a good chiropractor? You know, we need to ask these questions. And your social network is currently probably one of the more appealing ways of finding out some of that information. A church, of course, church and uh, clubs, uh, athletic clubs, rotary, any organizations that you belong to, they typically will have people who are representative um, of chiropractic in them. You can use those people as well. So keep your eyes and ears open, ask lots of questions. Once you develop a relationship with uh, a particular clinic, get to know the doctors that are, are there and find one that you can feel comfortable with. So that's the best way to find a uh, chiropractor who you can trust. Have a great day.